Well, this morning we're remembering 9-11, the hundreds of New York City police officers, firefighters and EMS who died saving lives 19 years ago today. Now you can honor their service and sacrifice at Floor Field this morning. Fox Carolina's Joe Gagdon is live from there with more from the Greenville Stair Climb, which is just getting ready to go underway right now, Joe. Indeed, Ted, we're just minutes away from when this is going to start at around 8.30, and you can already see the incredible men and women that are about to take part filling up here at Floor Field to try to climb more than 1,100 stairs to commemorate the 110 stories each of the World Trade Center buildings had inside. And so this is for anybody, too, not just firefighters and first responders. The public is invited to come out and do this stair climb with these amazing heroes who live among us here in the upstate of South Carolina. And what this day is about is to pay tribute to those FDNY firefighters and police officers and EMS who lost their lives on 9-11. It was 343 firefighters, it was 60 police officers, and it was 10 EMS first responders. And they're all going to be honored here today to know that the world will never forget what they did on that fateful morning. But we were able to interview Greenville City firefighter Thomas Tardo, who is also a paratrooper in the Army, and he was telling us about how important it is for the public to come out here and join these heroes alongside them. When we first started it, it was originally for just first responders. And uh, I didn't want to include civilians at first because I didn't want it to be a race and I didn't want it to be a competition. I wanted it to be a memorial stair climb. And then talking to people, you realize that it, it did affect everybody in the United States. It affected everybody, uh, all Americans. So uh, that's when we did open it up to the general public. And I mean, I'm, I'm glad we did because it, as you said, everybody remembers where they were when it happened and uh, it affected the nation. And so, of course, we'll bring it to you live as soon as this begins. And if, if you live downtown Greenville, if you can get here within the next 20 minutes, you could still register and take part and be alongside these incredible heroes, men and women alike. Back to you.